the world champion, now on the outside, as Pack runs at him and comes over the top with the Fosby flop. That caught screw when he returned. And there it is, Mark Arrow! Crushing Daniel Bryan and goes in for the cut. Wait a minute! A roll up, a roll up for Bryan, and Bryan retains. Stomping in the skull of Brian and now the rings have sat and this brutaliser to Daniel Bryan and the match is over for God's sake and now referees trying to break the hold. Brian, one more time I want you in three weeks and let me warn you when I don't get what I want I can be a real miserable bastard Clocks ticking, Brian. I'll see you in three weeks. Please. Right into the ropes, and Brian looking for a move here. Oh, no, wait a minute. Oh, my God. Asai Moonsault into a tornado DDT on the floor. Now Pack is on the stage. What the hell is he thinking now? 450 splash on the floor. Brian's out. I think Daniel Bryan might be knocked out. The bastard on the top rope. Red arrow into the knees. Oh my lord. And Bryan retains. What an insane counter to an insane move. Daniel still your NLW champion. Oh! Shinsuke Nakamura! The Kinshasa! Through the stage! Through the LED screen! We haven't seen this man since WrestleMania! And he's picking up where he left off with Daniel Bryan! And holds the NLW Championship symbolically! Ding. Shinsuke Nakamura! Sami Zayn allowing Cody to hit the disaster kick. Now wants to put it away with the crossroads, but gets out of it. And Ric Flair now on the apron, distracting the ref. Look out! It's Herman Page! But Adam Page is the buckshot on his own partner. And Cody in trouble! The Luba kick! And we have a new Intercontinental Champion. Sami Zayn has done it. Sami Zayn is the new Intercontinental Champion. Hangman Page is. this and I think Ricochet is also taken aback it is the master of the 619 Rey Mysterio he is a legend of Lucha Libre and he's a legend of No Limits Wrestling with a sleeper and I go for the pile driver put a runner into the ropes and here it comes 619 and Spring Rana and Rey Mysterio picks up the win in his return battle well, Rey Mysterio Samoa Joe running off the ropes but Gavin Owens with that chair oh my god blasting him in the face with that chair but Owens wants to continue the punishment Samoa Joe on the table outside Owens on the top over the senton my god jumping off the top Flying through the air and crashing through the table. Glass. Not a belly to belly. 
surely not but now Kevin Owens biting that was that desperation runs at Samoa Joe and a backdrop through the glass oh my god did you hear the smashing pieces as the glass shatters over the spine of Kevin Owens the stage on top of the titantron and oh my god Owens wants to throw Joe off the stage but wait a minute oh my god oh my lord Samoa Joe seems to be getting a bit too cocky and from the top rope the neck breaker this could be it the upset no Jeff Hardy kicks out Hardy cannot afford another loss but the Hurricane may well pull off the upset Chunk Slam coming no the rake to the eyes and for God's sake is that necessary oh what a twist of fate and stomps him for good measure well, that just goes to show you the new evil attitude of Jeff Hardy. He doesn't give a damn about anyone but himself. And the Swanton seals it. Jeff Hardy picking the victory against the Hurricane. Well, he is Mr. Money. When I want to do it, our friend, the Hurricane, that goof, he cost me a match against the Usos. And so I beat his ass. It's nothing personal. Maybe you should focus on yourself and less on that green idiot. Matt, I'm deadly serious. I've got the money in the bank contract. I can cash it in for an NLW title match anytime I want. You need to relax. Relax? I can't relax. You're putting yourself in danger. You don't want to become broken like me. You need to relax. In out of his condition. I don't know what to do with him. He's, he's, he's driving me mad. It's okay, Matt. You know, my horror senses were off a little bit that day. I screwed up. What's up with that? But I hold no ill feeling towards Jeff Hardy. But I appreciate you coming to apologize to me. Now if ever you're in trouble, or if anybody you know needs a superhero, point them in my direction. I'll see you, Matt. Whew. Wonderful. As of late, you need to delete this attitude that's got you into the state. Got me into this state? What the hell are you talking about, Matt? I'm Mr. Money in the Bank. I can do whatever the hell I want. I got a guaranteed world title right in this little briefcase here. And this matchup between Pac and Daniel Bryan, I'm watching it very, very closely. I don't need to be working out. I just need one of those guys to slip up. And I need to wait for the opportunity to strike. It's on the line. So right now, it is time for our main event. And the in-ring debut of Rowdy, Ronda Rousey. Sasha Banks is in for a fight tonight. Sasha As she the legs. And go for the back stabber, but look at that. The knee from Ronda. The Samoan drop. And now the arm bar. And Sasha Banks has to tap. A swift, painful victory. And she and Mayaba are now Bailey and Ronda being assaulted here. saw Becky Lynch she was taken out by Naomi and Tamina well she comes to the rescue of Ronda Rousey but I don't think Ronda is too happy that she did Ronda is staring daggers at the man but Becky Lynch and insult me I'm not gonna fire you but I'm gonna find you one hundred thousand dollars but of course, I will wave that farm if you come down to this ring and make me wave that farm. And that's the bottom line, because Stone Cold said so. Well, they're getting fine unless they make their way to the ring. And here they come. 
Adam Cole Bump. At the end of War Take. It's Roderick Strong. Roderick Strong assaulting Stone Cold Steve Austin. It was a ruse, a setup. They have ambushed Austin. And Adam Cole with a Panama Sunrise. That is their boss. And they have laid him out. And a Roderick Strong with his embrace with Adam Cole. Give me a break. It's disgusting. I doubt that, Roddy. But I can tell you this. The Undisputed Era is here to stay. And that's not just a fact, baby. That is undisputed. Ball of man. Chad Gable is in trouble. In the center of the ring. As the under Whoa, wait a minute. It's Omega! Omega dressed as the cameraman and the Grand Amplitude! And the American Alpha pick up the victory over the Ascension! But okay, Omega disguising himself as that cameraman, choking out the Undertaker with that cable. Kenny Omega! Mania. But if anyone can do it, it. Oh, wait a minute though! It's the good brothers Anderson and Gallows, and they lay out Kurt Angle on the stage. Well, they snuck up on Angle, allowing Balor to get an upper hand. Drop well, kick. Angle to the floor. Balor now measuring Angle. Where's he going? He's running off the ropes, and there it is, the Topic on Hello. Wiping out Angle. Kurt Angle wrenching on Balor's ankle. He may have to tap out. He's in the center of the ring, but a roll through. Has him hooked. And oh, for God's sake, Balor using the ropes for leverage. Out of the view of the referee, the Finn Balor going to sneak the victory here tonight. Yes. Balor just beating down Angle as... It... Hey! Oh my goodness, he's, he's eyeing up Angle. And Angle turns around. But he throws him out of the ring. And the brawl is erupted. Angle and Moxley. Not an Angle slam, no. Oh my God. Paradise shift off the stage. John. King Moxley, I cannot believe it. We have not seen this man in an LW in years. And he returns to attack everything in sight. John Moxley is here. And